Hi guys, before we start the video, I just want to mention real quick that the Clowny 1969 shirts are here and to get yours, check the description below for that link and this is what they look like, they come in different, different sizes and colors and this is a great way to show your support for my channel so let's go back to the video Welcome back guys, in this video I will be installing a Forever Sharp steering wheel These are some nice steering wheels these guys have and let's open this puppy up, see what we got here. We got some stickers. Thanks guys for the stickers. And it comes with the adapters that we need and for the horn stuff. So that's there. And let's see what we've got in here. go let's put the horn and let's see what the steering wheel looks like so you got here this comes in two pieces and you could get I believe in different colors whatever color you'd like and that's what's gonna look like with the horn button on top of course so let's put this bad boy in all right, so we're taking this Grant steering wheel off. This is a 79 Camaro. So we have eight Allen head bolts here. You pop that off. So there's holes back here on this plastic ring. I put two flathead screwdrivers here to pop this off. That pops off just like that. Take the spring off. These are three 11 millimeter bolts here. Take those off. Flip this out, pop this out. So this was actually loose. This thing wheel did have some play. So not good to the person who installed it. You fail. Pop that off. All right, now you need a steering wheel puller. Pop this in the middle, and you're gonna grab three bolts that are this thread size, and put those in here. And tighten them down. And that actually <laughs> came off nicely. Wow! Alright, so we're not going to put this in. They supply you with uh, a wire with a bell end and a spring and a black plastic clip. Uh, this was already there, so this is fairly new from the other steering wheel that was on here. And they also supply you with the ring here to space this out if anything rubs over here. But we're not going to use that either. Well, sometimes there's a spring there, we'd want to use that. So this is our adapter and we are going to install it like this put the wire through there and that's all the way in onto the splines so that's good all right now in this step if we actually put it here let me show you real quick you know, this wire always goes on the oval hole if it's going to go there then the steering wheel is going to look like this and we don't want that. So we want, what we want to do is, we want to put the wire in through here on this groove, then put the oval hole down here, and have it like that. So when we put the steering wheel on, now it's exactly where it's supposed to be. All right, so now let's take a step back. Remember, this is gonna go in the groove here. You put this on here. Just like that. This goes in the oval hole. 
right in the hole and then you align all the holes and put these hex bolts in. All right, now I'm gonna do some wiring before I put the third hex bolt in. I'm gonna cut this. This is what we need for the horn. So one, the middle one is gonna be for this one. I'm gonna put this on there. And the other side, we're gonna put an eyelet and put the other hex nut on it, the other hex bolt on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on here now. Tighten that down. So tug on this, and that's good. All right, so they supply you with these wires here. So I'm gonna cut that off, strip that. So I'm using one of these eyelets, and that goes on there perfectly. So I'm gonna put it on this side that I just stripped. Tug that, that's good. It's good. And put the hex bolt through, and put that right in there. And we're all tight. Put the nut in, and tighten her down. And we're good. Now put the retaining clip on. And make sure it moves around when you put it on, and that's good. Now we're gonna put the steering wheel together. You pop this in, you line up the threaded inserts in there, just like that. And they supply you with the five Allen screws. They're eighth inch heads. And go ahead and put all those in. And I'd go ahead, I went ahead and tightened all these down. So this is ready now. Okay, now we're gonna put this on. We're gonna temporarily put it on with one bolt here, just to hold it in place. All right, now this cap goes on top, but I'm gonna put these in first. And this goes in over here. That goes in the middle one. And this one is gonna go on this one here. And as you can see, the horn works. So now we just put this in place. Take that bolt I put in off. Line everything up and put the bolts in. And that's one. Got four more. And I'm going to start pattern, tighten these down. And they're all tight. Actually, this is real nice. And I do like it better than the Grand Steering Wheel, to be honest with you. So, I give this two clown thumbs up. I like it, I like it a lot. So, that concludes the installation of a forever sharp steering wheel. Follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, Clowny1969. Also, check out the description below for a link if you want a Clowny1969 shirt. Thanks for watching. See ya.